How you doing everyone? It's Kevin. I'm back with a little video here. I uh, got a project I've been working on. I, I had this old uh, log uh, bench at my uh, tree stand back over the hill and it's been back here for a long time. I built this probably 20 some years ago and one of the legs had rotted off of it. So I figured I'd get it down here, clean it up and replace uh, the legs on it. It's made from locusts uh, so I just had one leg that rotted off. I'll show you what I'm doing here. And uh, we're going to get some new legs put on this bench. This thing's not in the best of health, but it's still got, it's good and solid yet. This leg here was the one that broke off. And all I've been doing is going down in here and digging the old uh, leg out. Uh, I did get one leg out. This one was on this side over here. And I got it out. So... We're going to work on finish cleaning out this hole here uh, and then we're going to get on the other side and get them legs out too. They all got to come out and we're just going to replace them. We're going to sand the board. We're going to sand the log down a little bit just to clean it up and uh, get our back bench back to normal. And the crazy thing about these legs, I, I, I didn't glue them. There's nothing holding them in there. They're just shoved in the holes. So really... If we beat them around enough, we should be able to get them to come out. Uh, I just uh, got them about the right size and then I beat them in with a hammer. And like I said, they've been like that for, I'd say about 20 years. One of the legs just finally rotted off. These ones aren't that great either. But we're going to get them out, get us some new legs. Takes a little bit to get them out of there. Okay, there's our old leg. So we got another one out. We're going to go ahead and I'm going to work on this one and we'll be able to clean this thing up a little bit and cut us out some new legs. Okay, I just got the palm sander out here. We're going to clean the board up. And I think the best way to clean it is to use some sandpaper. Now this is the part that gets the weather, so it's going to be a lot worse. But we're going to get her as best we can. Now all we gotta do is we gotta get us some legs. Don't look too bad, I think it looks fairly decent for an old bench. Okay, we got our legs. We got some old dry wood. This is dry, I didn't wanna put wet in there because it would shrink. So all we gotta do now is carve the ends of these and get them set down in the holes. And that's basically consists in just shaving these down till they fit in our hole we don't want them to fit right down inside there so that's what i'm going to work on right now getting these shaved down and put in the holes
Okay, that's all I did with the other ones, and I think these ones will be just as good, just the same. Okay, legs are on. Okay, that should uh, last another few years. It's not uh, locust, but they'll last a while. What I was doing there is just leveling out the legs. The legs are just in every direction, but you know, it's not a, I guess, a fancy piece of furniture, but it'll do. Trying to get some of the bark off the legs there. Because that bark will hold moisture in there. So I'm just going to go ahead and skin all these legs down real good. Well, this is a bench I built years and years ago. My goodness, it, it, it had to be 20 years I've had this bench sitting in the woods. It's been everywhere here. And the uh, leg finally rotted off of it, so I figured we'd put some new legs on it and uh, use it again. Uh, recycle the legs and put them in the wood pile so we can burn the legs. And uh, the, the, the tables or the, the little bench is back to normal again. We got four legs, good and sturdy too, so hopefully it'll last quite a few years. I might let this thing dry out a little bit and then just go ahead and put some linseed oil on it. Maybe uh, that linseed oil will help it from rotting up. So I would like to tell everybody thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave me a thumbs up, thumbs down, or a comment if you'd like. Till next time.